Hi, the topic of this video is going to build an Arch Linux B, but a minimal one. So in December 2018, we've made five more Arch Linux B minimals. At this point, we are counting of 12 desktops, 12 desktops with an Arch Linux B and an Arch Linux B minimal. So 24 plus Arch Linux and plus Arch Linux D, 26 ISOs. But um, it sounds incredible, but it's just one file that we've changed. It's just a package file. It's one ISO, then a derivative is Arch Linux D, and um, then we derive all the others from um, Arch Linux. So it's basically one ISO that we're having and that we're maintaining. But like I always try to tell people, it is just a Lego box. Get the things you want. Decide what to build. Decide what desktop you need. 12 desktops have been uh, now explored and Xmonad is the last one. So I'm going to make a video for this one. Build your own ISO, Xmonad minimal. So this is, could be the look. And it's, uh, the weather is light intensity drizzle, eight degrees at this point in time in Belgium. It's the 1st of January, 2019. And um, let's do this, let's build this. So the only thing you need to remember is a few steps here. If you've seen one video, you've seen them all. It's always the same procedure. Control C, move that out of the way. Go, your, go to your Arch Linux or Arch Linux system. And then you go to desktop, for instance, right mouse click, open terminal. And you are going to Control Shift V this thing. Git clone me. In other words, get the data from internet and put it on my machine. And then you have this file here, folder here with lots of elements. And what does it say? It tells you that if you want to change, you don't need to change. If you want to change packages 86 and 64 there, then you can do so. It's in here. Pages 86, 64. Uh, let's do something else like, I don't know. Let's do Firefox. Is Firefox installed? No. So in our vision, and it shouldn't be your vision, it's just a file, just a text file of only 600 lines. Okay. So you look up Firefox and you say, yes, I do want Firefox. Yes means it needs to be like this. Great tip that I'll include in the video as well. Help. We are on Sublime Text. Go in here to Plain Text, choose Perl, and then I can say to you, everything that's black is not on the ISO. So you see Chromium, and now Chromium will be on the ISO. It's that simple. Use the script, put whatever you like on the system, you like evolution, Put evolution on the ISO, and once you uh, install it on VirtualBox or an SSD, evolution and, and Chromium will be installed. It's just up to you to decide what you put on your machine and what you don't put on your machine. So it's a lot of um, freedom to get, and uh, the end result will be virtually a system that 99% is okay, and all the rest that you can't do, you use a script like we have our own Nemesis script to install after any Arco Linux installation. We'll install more stuff like Spotify, Dropbox, Instinct, stuff that we don't want to put on the ISO, but that you maybe would like to have. So that's for a script later after a clean installation. All right, so Ctrl Z, you decide what goes on here. If you save that, I did not save anything, it's still the same thing. You go to this folder and it says number 30. Open the terminal there. Run script 30. And if it's the first installation, it won't take very long. But of course, it's not my first installation. So it says here, deleting the build folder, if one exists, takes some time. So if this is the first time, it will be already running. But if it's the second time you run this, Thing, then it's going to delete all these gigabytes of data and that will take a while. Basically, from now on, everything will be automatically. You can walk away, go have a walk, um, go eat, 
and in let's say 10 to 15 minutes depending on the hardware cpu and etc and of course the internet connection you'll get your uh, iso so the result is not uh, well is an iso is in, in a file that you can load up in virtualbox that you can burn on usb let's wait all right it finished um, and we have 1.5 gigabytes and the result is in the Arch Linux B out folder and it's the one here Arch Linux B X monad minimal of uh, 1st of January of 2019 all right enjoy building your own uh, ISOs next thing is loading it up in virtual box trying it out if you say no i'm missing this package or that package change the file again burn it again or make it again the iso and then you can burn it on a usb for your machine all right cheers